Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to explain about the process of binary addition, subtraction, multiplication and division concepts. In binary addition, it is somewhat different from the normal addition and there are some rules we cannot add directly 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. Okay, that is wrong. In binary addition, uh, 0 plus 0, it is 0. 0 plus 1, it is 1. 1 plus 0 it is 1 but when you are adding 1 and 1 it is not 2 it is 1 0 okay in binary addition we have to remember that all the numbers all the digits are in ones and zeros only okay even if you add 1 and 1 it is like 1 0 that means in binary format 1 0 is nothing but 2 only okay 2 power 0 into 0 and 2 power 1 into 1 it is nothing but 2 only but that 2 is represented in binary digits okay so 1 plus 1 is 1 0 where 0 you can call that 0 as sum and 1 as carry okay so we have to remember this suppose for example when you are taking the addition of two numbers like 1 1 0 1 dot 1 0 1 and another number is 111.011. Suppose if you are asked to add these two, it is a binary addition. Okay, it is not normal addition like 1 plus 1 is equal to 2, that is wrong. Okay, when in binary addition, 1 plus 1 is 0 and 1 here. This 1 is known as carry, which could be added to the next number. So again, 1 plus 0, 1, and again, 1 plus 1, it is. 0 it is 1 so 1 plus 1 again it is 0 here and 1 here now see 1 plus 1 plus 1 3 ones are here so 3 ones means 1 plus 1 is 1 0 1 0 plus 1 it is 1 1 so 1 is here and one more 1 is here so 1 plus 0 1 1 plus 1 it is 0 and 1 again triple 1 1 1 so 1 1 is 1 0 this is the result when you are adding these two numbers okay so binary addition is binary addition or binary subtraction or multiplication or division they are having some rules we should follow it is not like your simple normal integer addition now coming to binary subtraction binary subtraction 0 minus 0 if the two input bits are 0 and 0 then the result is 0 1 minus 1 is also 0 normal subtraction 1 minus 0 it is 1 but when you are subtracting 1 from 0 that is nothing but 0 minus 1 the result is 1 but with a borrow with borrow as 1 with a borrow of 1 hope you understand so 0 minus 1 except this remaining all three values are normal subtraction 0 minus 0 0 1 minus 1 it is 0 1 minus 0 is 1 but 0 minus 1 gives 1 with a borrow 1 okay the subtraction of this binary subtraction is somewhat different it is not that much easy okay you have to do with care suppose consider for example 1010 dot 010 okay and another number is 111 dot triple one so you are subtracting the first number and second number then see here 0 minus 1 0 minus 1 the result is 1 with a borrow 1 Again here, 1, 1, but he has this one goes to this one. Already in the previous case, we have taken borrow from this second digit to the first digit. So that's why here we have 0. Again, one more borrow will come. The result is 1. Again here, we are taking, already we have taken 1. So 1 minus 1, it is 0. Coming to this one, 
again 0 minus 1 already we have given 1 in the previous case so 1 minus 1 it is 0 and now 1 minus 1 but this one is already given in the previous case as a borrow so 0 minus 1 this is 1 and again here borrow is 1 1 minus 1 0 it is 0 because this one is already taken as borrow so this is the result okay so when you are doing subtraction between two binary digits you have to carefully understand where the borrow is going on this is binary subtraction coming to the third type is binary multiplication binary <coughs> multiplication so binary multiplication it is like array multiplication okay when you are having digits in sequence they are normally how you are going to multiply in the integer format the same kind here we are going to do but the, when you are performing addition you have to do binary addition okay after multiplication see 0 into 0 this is 0 0 into 1 this is 0 1 into 0 this is 0 but 1 into 1 it is 1 okay 1 into 1 it is 1 normal multiplication so for, suppose for example you are taking 1101 and 110 so these two numbers are going to be multiplied so number first number consisting of four digits and second number consisting of four digits so 1101 by 110 1101 is nothing but your 13 and 110 is nothing but your 6 so 13 into 6 you are performing here so first you need to multiply this 0 with all these digits nothing but 4 zeros will come again you are going to multiply this one with all these numbers so 1101 so how you are normally performing your multiplication in the similar way you will do here also Again, you are multiplying the above first number with the 1. So, 1, 1, 0, 1. Now, you add 0. 0 plus 1 is 1. 0 plus 0 plus 1 is 1. 0 plus 1 plus 0 is 1. 1 plus 0, now it is 0. And 1, 1 is carry. So, 1 and 1 is 1, 0. This is the result. Okay. So binary multiplication is easy addition is also easy only subtraction may be somewhat difficult when you are having borrows and binary division binary division so binary division is also like your normal division like for example you are having 110 and 101101 like this so, so you need to divide this 101101 with 110 okay so here you have quotient and here you have remainder so first you are multiplying with 1 so 110 will come that 110 so see 110 this is 6 but 101 this is 5 only you cannot take 110 here so that's why you have to take here okay so the result is 1010 again 0 will come here 1010 now again one more time 1 this is 10 minus 6 it is 4 so 100 again this one will come here one more time 110 see this is 9 this is 6 result is 3 1 1 take 0 then dot take 0 this is one more time 110 remainder is 0 0 0 0 ok so when you are dividing this number with 110 the result is triple one dot one ok in this way we can perform any type of arithmetic operation addition subtraction multiplication division using the binary numbers binary digits thank you